Sure is trying to dedicate some snow and some winter weather for us, at least yeah, for she needs a, to take a break. day. We take haven't seen break. this extreme combination of everything, Michael, happening at the same time. Snow, wind, cold, wind chills, rough driving and road conditions all at the same time. I would say if you don't have to go anywhere tonight, it's okay. You can skip it. There'll be plenty of time this weekend if you got to get out and do something fun or run some errands or take care of something for the weekend. Live Triple Doppler brought to you by Falso Service Experts. I'm watching one, two, three, four, five. I lost count. Multiple bands of weak to moderate lake effect snow. I'm going to double click on Onondaga County, kind of zoom in, tilt the view, show you some of the suburbs being affected right now. Casanova down towards New Woodstock, Pompey, Manlius, Fayetteville, Bridgeport, Cicero up by the airport down to downtown Syracuse, out towards Baldwinsville, Camillus, Westvale, Fairmount, over towards Otisco and Tully. All right, so Allure Lagarde has been in Weather 31, basically going back and forth on 690 between Syracuse and Camillus, and there's a heavy snow squall kind of working south across 690 right now. Visibility reports have been coming in, kind of fluctuating around because the snow bands have been fluctuating around as well. A third of mile visibility here in Syracuse, same thing for Skinny Atlas, half a mile visibility for Fulton, Sotus, a mile visibility in Hamilton and under a mile right now in the Norwich area. Now we do have a weather alert for the snow tonight. It's not a warning, it's an advisory. It's basically a travel advisory, winter weather advisory that is. Now until 4 o'clock in the morning for Onondaga, Cortland, Cayuga, Wayne counties. Persistent but steady, you know, lake effect snow keeping the roads greasy and icy with the visibility being knocked down at times. Travel is not really recommended unless you absolutely have to go somewhere. If not, I would say kind of wait it out at least for tonight. Wind gusts reported right now 20 to 30 miles per hour. Look at Fulton reporting near 40 mile per hour wind gusts. This can catch you off guard. You're driving, the snow is flying in front of you. You see the vehicle in front of you. On the sudden, the drift comes by, blowing snow. You can't see the vehicle in front of you. That can be kind of scary. Temperature right now, air temperature hovering right near zero, and that's why the rock salt in the brine is not very effective at this time. And with the winds whipping around, this is the real field temperature, is what your skin is telling your brain. 19 below here in Syracuse, 22 below for Ithaca, as well as Fulton, 20s below zero, near 30 below up to the north. All right, so rough with the cold. Wind chill warnings continue along and east of 81. Wind chill advisories for our counties to the west. And this is all the way through midday tomorrow. Here's our future wind chill graphic. This may be a little bit aggressive, but it kind of gives you the idea. 20s below zero in spots this evening. We ease down teens near 20 below zero. Still cold tomorrow morning. And then we finally relax the winds, relax the cold. And by tomorrow afternoon, we should have wind chills mainly above zero, but still single digits isn't fun to be outside. Snowfall forecast. If you're in the light blue here, west and southwest of Syracuse, Camillus, Marcellus, Skinny Atlas, Auburn, Cato, or towards Scipio, Moravia, Spafford, and Tully. Yeah, two inches, maybe three, some spots four inches. East of Syracuse in the gray, maybe a half inch to an inch or two here or there. All right, next seven days, we're going 19 for tomorrow after a morning low of nine below. It won't be as harsh tomorrow afternoon. The snow should cut off. We'll see some partial sun. Feeling like spring comes Sunday. Feeling like 65 degrees warmer than tomorrow morning. And look at that, 30s and 40s chance for some rain on Tuesday. It's going to be warm for February, approaching 50. And also more chance for rain on Thursday and a mixed shower batch on Friday. Thank you.